Hello guys, welcome back to my vlog. Today we are going to be, you guys are going to be helping me and commenting, commenting, blah, commenting down below what the answers are. And then I will see if you're correct. But obviously, let's go ahead and get into it. So first we're obviously going to do our, our math. And so obviously I've done a lot of them, but I have only have one, two, three three left and I actually have averaging to do. I love adger averaging. They're the best things in the world. So I guess we can go ahead and get into averaging. Averaging is like the most steps out of this. But so bing bing four dollars and thirty one cents plus six dollars and seventy six cents plus two dollars and forty nine cents. We add that all up. Um 16, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 15, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 13 dollars is our adamant. And obviously we have to divide 3 divided by 13, 56 dollars. All right. How many times will 3 go into 13? Obviously, 4 times, because 4 times 3 equals 12. 12 minus that will equal 1. Bring down your 5 will equal 5. 5. <sighs> Sorry. 5 times uh, 3 equals 15. Minus that will equal 0. Bring down your 6. That would equal 2. That would equal 6. Minus that will equal 0. So your answer is $4.52 in averaging. That is your answer. And that is how you do it in one minute. Basically two, but all right. Next one, 142 plus 150 plus 168 plus 149 plus 137. Plus those will equal nine, okay, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. It's 17. 17 plus 17, it will equal 24. 24 plus 5 will equal 29. 10, 11, 6, hold on, 6, 7, 8, 8, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 21, 22, 23, 23. Bring your 2, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. And that's how you basically do it in two minutes as well. These take a long time, guys. These take quite a while. All right, I have an eraser in here. I'm going to use that. Let's right. <laughs> stuff your nose. <laughs> stuff your nose. All right, now we have to divide by five. We're equal. Sorry, guys, I'm planting here. All right, um, that will obviously equal... My brother's singing in the background. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 70. Woo! Woo, 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 How many times will 5 go into 7? Obviously, 1 time, that would equal 5. Minus that would equal 2. Bring down your 3. That would obviously equal 4. 4 times 5 would equal 20. 20 minus that would equal 3. Run down your nine. Seven. Seven times five will equal thirty-five. Minus that will equal four. And your remainder is four. So obviously we have to write this as a fraction. One hundred and forty-seven and four fifths. And we have two answers that we need to go through. Obviously, I don't know any of these, so I'm gonna go ahead and look them up. Um, I know you guys think it's cheating. I don't know the answers to these, and I'm not a perfect person in all my life. But sometimes I just need to look them up. This is not happening at all. Hmm. I need grams. I need grams. Where's the grams? Alright, I have 
to look this up on my phone, of course. So, I'm going to go find my phone or my mom's phone. And I'll be right back. Oh, boy, oh, boy. Let's take forever to find my phone. I'm just going to use my mom's. No. This was yesterday. Oh my gosh. Alright. I am back and it took me six minutes, but I'm gonna look this up. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Alright. No 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 no. I have to go to Google for this. More voice now that more voice it. What does one H G equal how many grams? I don't know. It will come up. Alright, one hundred grams. That's our answer. One hundred grams. Now we have to ask them again. What does M equal how many MM? Search. 1,000 millimeters. <sighs> okay, hold on. I got a voicemail and another one. What does MDCXVI equal? I know it's taking me eight minutes to do this, but it's been forever. 1616, that's what it equals. Really? Really? Wow. That will literally. Alright, 1616 is what it is. 1616. And that is all our math. I'm sorry that did not take long, but I have to work on my brochure. That is a long, long, long process. And I only have a couple minutes to do that. And I really need to do it. Oh, I'm going to show you this picture that Brock drew me. I have a student named Brock. And he drew me a peacock. Because I literally got a huge peacock. It's way up there. You guys cannot see it. But thank you guys. But thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoy. And hope you guys will be able to comment on this video. And subscribe. And hit the notification bell so you do not miss a single video. And also, don't forget, don't forget to hit the like button so I can get more content and everything else. Thank you guys so much for watching this video again, and hope you guys have a wonderful night. Goodbye, and hope you got guys. If you do not do your homework, I am not gonna be happy. Guys, do your homework. It's good. It's good for you. You learn things in the process. But I'm going to leave that at that. And I hope you guys have a wonderful night.